Welcome to Inside the Igloo, Season 2, Episode 4. Let's get started. Today we're going to be raiding Senior's parking spots, and um, let's just get started. We're here at parking spot number one. This appears to be Kylie Clem's. Uh, what do you boys think about it? It's a nice, simple design. It's clean. I think I rated a 7 out of 10. All right, Justin, you? 7 out of 10. Uh, it looks pretty nice. I rated a 7.5 out of 10. All right, now we are at parking spot number three, which appears to be McKenna Ibling. How do you guys feel about this one? Pretty good. A lot of creativity. Eight out of ten. Um, you know, it looks like really simple, you know, and I don't really like the colors. I'm gonna give it a five point five out of ten. And uh, honestly, here the colors. Honestly, I, I like green. It's got some cheetah print. Um, I'll give it a seven out of ten. Except a little bias here. The parking spot is 10 times bigger than all of ours. What is going on? That's dropping at 6 out of 10. Unfair. Here at parking spot number 4, it looks like it's Cooper Thomas's. What do you think of this one, Carter? Honestly, I gotta be honest. There's a, the font is cool. It's a cherry Pepsi can. I mean, he's even got the cherries. They look a little shadowed in. Gonna have to give this one a 9 out of 10. Um, you know, I like the colors, and it looks like he did really good. Um, I'll give it a 8.5 out of 10. I agree with Carter here. It's a really nice design, really nice uh, Pepsi can logo, but I'm more of a Coke guy. I'm going to have to rate it a 9.5 out of 10. We are at parking spot number 5, which is Bianca Eppling. So, rate this one out of 10. A 10. I like the colors. Um, the parking spot's full. I rate it an 8 out of 10. 8 out of 10. Nice spot. <laughs> yeah, I really like the colors. Um, definitely took some effort. I give it a 9 out of 10. We're here at Clay Rager's parking spot. What do you rate it, boys? Honestly, it's super basic. Um, it looks like big footprint. Gonna have to give this one a 2 out of 10. You know, it's simple, but it's clean. I'm gonna give it a 4 out of 10. Nice parking spot. Good job, Clay. 8 out of 10. We're here at parking spot 15, which seems to be Sean Coleman. Uh, what do you guys think? I'd rate it a 4 out of 10. 4.1 out of 10. You want my personal opinion? If you do 4.1 minus 4, you get 0.1. That's out of 10. All right, we're here at Justin Reffitt's parking spot number 17. What do you boys think about it? Honestly, it's very creative. Uh, you can definitely tell it took some time. Polar bear looks a little off, but overall, this is really good. I'm giving this a 9 out of 10. Yeah, I have to agree with Carter, though. Polar bear, it looks a little messed up. But everything else looks good. I'll give it a 7.5 out of 10. I want to thank my mom and grandma for putting all the work in this spot. I give it a 9.5 out of 10. We are at parking spot number 20. It seems to be uh, Carter Curtis, whoever that is. Um, I say you did a decent job. Uh, what do you boys think? Good job, Carter. Nice spot. 8 out of 10. You uh, filled up all the space in the parking spot here. You got the soggy bottom boys. If you know, you know. Rated a 9 out of 10. Right. Now, obviously, this Carter Curtis guy seems pretty cool. I'm going to have to give it a 10. Oh. I'm here with Kalani. How's kindergarten going so far? I don't know. <laughs> Who's your best friend? Ivy. Ivy. Hey, who am I here with? Roman. Uh, what grade are you in? Um, kindergarten. Uh, who's your best friend in kindergarten? Everett and Grayson. Okay. Once again, I am here with the mystery man. So, Hard Northern has a football game against Whitefield Goshen. How do you feel that's going to go? This should be a big fight this week. Tiger versus the polar bear. I think on our home ground, the tundra, should be a polar bear advantage there. Unsung hero this week, the man with the raging pythons, the biceps, Justin Reffitt. I see him possibly, I'm predicting five, maybe six pancake blocks, and perhaps a defensive score when he picks up the running back with the ball and runs with running back and all, 80 yards for the touchdown. Might be the boldest prediction yet. Let's see if it happens. Go Bear. <laughs> so how long have you been working this game today? Today? About uh, four hours now. It hurts so much. Your feet or your hands from pushing all that My feet, my hands just smell. So.
for the show as a disco dom. Uh, disco dom gaining momentum. Need a man falling down. They run off the ropes. Need a rest of the budget. Come on, baby. Someone's got to fall. Inside the igloo. See you next week.